Last year, we did a shoot together around the city, just random different spots. Found a really dope spot in Cambridge. And um, we're gonna try to link up again. He said he has a new dip color and all sort of stuff. So, you know, yeah, so he just wants to do some update photos of his car, which is pretty dope, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, I like being a part of that process where people get to capture, you know, the builds along the way. As the upgrading bits and pieces and stuff. Oh my god, I gotta clean this car. This car is a mess. But those who do know me, who is that ever not? Yeah, but like I said, right now we're gonna go ahead and grab DJ real quick. Gotta let the car warm up, everything air up, most of the stuff. Jeez, why is the AC on? DJ, I'll see you guys in a bit. Peace. My office is now at my house. Like, they let me take all my stuff home. That's crazy. So I can just do all my work from home. I don't have to go nowhere. Damn. So this is like my first time out, out, all week long. That quarantine life is crazy, bro. It is, dude. It's crazy. It's crazy. Oh, man. She's looking good. Looking good. I see you switch it up. Ooh. I see the flake. So he's like, all right, well, pick another color. We'll do a, another color for you. I was like, all right, I had another color in mind. It was very close to this. This wasn't the original color. Yeah. So the Worcester Auto Show, the same one that happens in Boston, happens out in Worcester. My car was there in his booth last year. Yeah. He's like, listen, I want your car for the booth. I have a color in stock that I can do your car. If you let me do your car in this color, I'll do it for free. I was like, seriously. Hey. I was like, hey, works out for everybody. Yeah, yeah, I'll do that. So, this is the color he picked. So, so far different from anything else I've, yeah. I've ever ever imagined having on this. But, like, the, yeah. the just the flake in it is absolutely insane. Like, from far away, it's harder to see, but once you get ready. Nah, I can see it, dude. <laughs> I can definitely so, see it. But, yeah. Yeah, no, I, uh,. I like it. It's growing on me. It turns a ton of heads too. Like yeah. I just keep seeing like, oh shit. No, nah, it that? definitely looks tough because when I uh, pulled in from down the street, I was like, yeah, there he is. There he is. <laughs> yeah, no, it's, it's uh, definitely definitely stands out. I mean, I, I I gotta say, I miss the I miss the pink and neon yellow one. Like yeah. I really love that color because that like everybody looked at it like, what are you doing? Yeah, that. Why pop, would you waste like money? Crazy. Why would you do that? Uh, to upset everybody in our scene. I guess like nobody was doing it. So I was like, oh, yeah. fuck it. I'll nah, but it's the thing though. When you got cars, like especially with these, they're starting to pop up more and more. Yeah. And with Subarus, it's no different. You yeah. got to do something to stand out. Yeah. Like, you yeah. got to do something to stand yeah, out. Yeah, and like, it's the same thing. It's like, I look at like, uh, take Derek's car for example. Like, yeah. I love the way Derek's car looks. I love the way it sits. Mm -hmm. I love everything about it. But like, everybody around here is now like bagging their infinities. Every Q50. Yeah. Is starting to get bad. Like Franklin, his yeah. is like the same thing. So he's got he switched up a different body kit on his, but yeah, like we got the blitz kit, right? Yeah. yeah. So when everybody's kind of starting to do the same thing, it's like ah, like find something to stand out, be a little bit different. Trust know? me, I definitely understand it. When I uh, I was nervous about that color because I originally wanted that color on my RSX. Yeah. But then my guy did it for me and I loved it. And then everybody's like, damn, you went from the red Subaru. Yeah, I guess you did the green Subaru, and yeah. I'm just like, ah, you know what? I just had to be different because yeah. everybody and their mother in, in the scene, bro, especially the 15 WRX. Yeah, I'm so glad I didn't buy one. Yeah, like I'm so glad because when you go to the shows now, it's yeah. fucking like 30 of them. Yeah, and they all got yeah. pretty much the same stuff. Well, I so. mean, that's because up here, like, everybody loves Subarus up here. Yeah. I mean, the New England weather. I mean, it's it's great for yeah. this. Is, this has been great in the New England weather. I mean, 
even as even as low as it is. Yeah. I mean, I don't uh, I don't have the time or patience, yeah. or sometimes the money to raise it up in the winter time. I'm just like, just do it. So. You know. All right, guys, we're gonna head out to the spot. See y'all in a little bit. Peace. So we're going into BJ's. We go to pick stuff up, and she's like, uh, "Hey, they have uh, you know the liquor store here." And I'm like, all right, yeah, we'll stop by. And I'm roaming around the liquor store, and I have like this giant, massive bottle of vodka um, that it, no, I will never drink it. I just, I bought it just in case. It's like, all right, maybe I need this for disinfectant. Maybe yeah, I just yeah, need yeah. to, you know, put on a rag, wash my hands, or something like that. If I have a cut and I run anything, out of, anything, dude. Yeah. Because time, the way how they're speaking, they're literally saying like, yo, it's gonna get real, dude. Yeah. Like oh, yeah. they're really saying the way how Trump projected. Oh yeah, there's gonna be at least two hundred thousand you know, deaths yeah. because of this, like, and or it, impacted yeah. by it. And the whole, I mean, the whole thing is nuts. Like, I, I listen to the, like, all politics aside with everything yeah. else, like, I just listen to him speak, and yeah. I'm like, oh, how? How is, how did this guy, how did this guy get here? You know, because I'm like, hey, he doesn't inspire a lot of confidence. The other, like, that Fauci guy, yeah. um... The Fauci's a real, this yeah. dude, Trump was like, yeah, we're going to be offset by Easter. Yeah. And he was just like, hey, yeah, no, there's it's no like, timeline on yeah, this. Yeah, I don't know like, what the hell this guy's talking about, but like, yeah. we can get him out of I'm here. I'm like, <laughs> as soon as he said it's like, we're really hoping to be done by Easter, uh, you know, we hope uh, we hope things will be back up. Easter's a great holiday. Everybody loves Easter. It's like, yeah, yeah, yeah we all love Easter and all, but we all like not being sick. So. Oh, shit, there goes Derek calling right now. Hold on a second. <laughs> yeah. Who are you headed towards us? Oh, you're on Newberry Street? That's where we're headed. Alright. Alright, cool. Once we get there, I'll share a location. Alright. They're claiming how it's getting, man. It's just not yeah. worth it to be putting people at risk. Yeah, right. Like that. That's why, like, with the shoots, I've been like really just because my son has asthma, yeah, and my daughter has respiratory issues. So I'm just like, you know what? Yeah, you want to be as cautious I, I, as possible. Yeah, dude, like, so, like, with the vlogs, I've just been like, ah, you know what? Every once in a while, I'm not gonna be like, you know, usually right now around the season, like, I'm banging out the shoots left and right yeah, and stuff right? like that, but That's I'm like, you know, like, it's not worth it. Dude. By this time, like, everybody's already been to, like, three or four meets, yeah. like, everybody's getting, you know, reacclimated to, to stuff with everybody, and it's like, not a lot of photographers are out shooting. Like, I see, like, a lot of photographers that, like, want to get out and want to yeah. shoot, um, but, like, not a lot of people are going out because of this. Alright, guys, we're gonna see y'all in a bit. We're gonna hop out the car, start grabbing some shots. Peace. What up, sunshine? Okay. Corona life, corona life. Corona life. Happy birthday today. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Birthday boy. We're in the strip club. There's going to be nobody there. It's going to be virtual. All right, we'll grab some tough shots and then we'll hit that alleyway and uh, see what's up. All right, guys. Spot number one. We're going to test it out. We're going to see you in a bit. Peace. Um, so I always wanted to just get something of my own that I could do. 
Um, how I ended up getting into this uh, was basically the AC blew on my old car, and I ended up wanting something that had air conditioning in it and a warranty because my old car didn't have one. <laughs> so, um, I didn't want Bugs. to pay for stuff as it broke. Um, I basically just wanted something that I could, uh, you know, send to a dealership and get fixed. The reason I picked this car, though, because uh, I knew I could modify it. One of the first things I had searched for was whether a supercharger kit was made for it or a turbo kit was made for it. Lit. <laughs> so I knew if I could find either a turbo kit or a supercharger kit made for it, there'd be a community for modding it. So I, uh, I found out Stillman made a supercharger kit for it. I don't have it. Maybe one day. We'll see. Uh, but I ended up uh, starting out with just uh, Takeda intakes and a tune on it. I had uh, a place called Lars Virus Tuning do my tune. It was all remote tuned. Um, they took care of me and like putting a tune on this above bass just or even just bass tune like really brought this thing alive like it, it was just a totally different car to drive um, eventually I had uh, you know I had run out of really things I could do with it so this is now my fourth iteration of the dip on this <laughs> so uh, I have I have such a compulsion problem it's not even funny I'll change my dip once a year just because of the wind shift I don't I don't even care so uh, Landry's Custom did the dip for me on it uh, when they did my first dip this is now the third dip he's done for me um, when I first brought to him to do the dip I was like you know what let's do everything while it's there so he dropped it on PC coilovers for me threw my AG M540s on there for me um, did my custom uh, midsection for my exhaust so I have uh, high flow caps so custom midsection all the way up to a Tanabe exhaust um, had it retuned by RT Tuning out in Pennsylvania uh, they did a great job on it uh, after I had lip mode tuning throw in some 3 inch cold air intakes on it so it actually has like one of the only sets of true cold air intakes for an Infiniti Q50 on it um, I, think, I don't think any other companies are really doing them right now so but it has, uh, has enough get up and go for me but I think my next future plans uh, probably send it back to limp mode uh, for a single turbo Dang. So, when, the, when the money comes in, when that stimulus check hits, <laughs> we'll see if I'll send it up to Limbo for them to do, a, uh, to do a turbo on it. But I, I, I love it. I like to, I mean, it's comfortable. It's my daily driver. Um, I'd love to, I'd love to keep it like that, it's, you know, for as long as I can. And we'll, you know, we'll see if I don't bust it up if I put a turbo on it. <laughs> I'd have to buy a, uh, you know, a normal daily driver and just have this as race car. GTR swap, I'm just saying. Yeah, I know, right? The GTR right? swap. Come up with, and not just the regular, you know, not yeah. the new one. I want RB26 in this. Yeah. 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 But, all right, guys, I'm gonna drop his IG in the description box below. Make sure you show some love, give him a follow, and we're gonna head out. And I'll see you guys in just a bit. All right, peace. All right, guys, we're gonna wrap this one up. Wanna thank the homie for coming out. Uh, definitely a lot of stories shared. We went down the sketchy alleyway never doing that again bottom out crazy <laughs> but um it was dope catching up especially with all this stuff going on and just to get a moment to get outside and like i said you guys definitely want to stay home and be safe and if you are going to go out just be careful and stuff like that take precautions and advise the necessary risks but all right man appreciate coming out bro appreciate it corona corona corona, corona. <laughs> All right, man, stay up. Once again, appreciate you coming through, bro. Drive safe. All right, guys, I'm going to wrap this one up. You guys stay up. Stay blessed. You know the vibes. Peace.